the electrostatic force on a small sphere of charge 0.4 microcoulomb due to another small sphere of charge minus 0.8 microcoulomb in the air is 0.2 newton what is the distance between the two spheres and what is the force on the second sphere due to the first so we are having two charges here q1 is 0.4 microcoulomb that is 0.4 into 10 raised to minus 6 coulomb then we have q2 minus 0.8 microcoulomb which is minus 0.8 into 10 raised to minus 6 coulomb and here we have the force as 0.2 newton force is 0.2 newton what is the distance between the two spheres that is the first question we know that f equals k q1 q2 by r square here what we have to find we need to find the distance between the two spheres that is r is what we need to find so r square would be k q1 q2 by f which is 9 into 10 raised to 9 into 0.4 into 10 raised to minus 6 into 0.8 into 10 raised to minus 6. Here I am not taking minus because in this equation we only consider the magnitude of the charges. Okay. Divided by F. F is 0.2 Newton. Okay, so this 0 0.2, 0 0.4. Here it will be 0 0.2. So R square would be 9 into 0 0.2 into 0 0.8. 9 into 0 0.2 into 0 0.8 into 10 raised to 9 into 10 raised to minus 6. 10 raised to minus 6. Okay. And this will give us 144 into 10 raised to minus 4 meter. Okay. 144 into 10 raised to minus 4 meter is the R square. What we need to find? We need to find R. Now R would be the root of 144 into 10 raised to minus 4 that is 0.112 meter 0.112 meter is the distance between the two spheres 0.112 meter now what is the force on the second sphere due to the first that is the second question now here see look at this the electrostatic force on a small sphere of charge this due to another small sphere of charge this in the air is 0 0.2 newton so for both these charges the force is the same here one is positive okay this is positive here we are having negative charge so both the spheres are attracting each other with the same force right both the spheres attract each other with the same force Therefore, what can we conclude? We can say that the force in the second sphere due to the first sphere will also be same. Therefore, the force on the second sphere due to the first is point. 2 newton itself ok 
कि दिस इज द आंसर कि अब बोथ द स्फीयर्स अट्रैक्ट ईच अदर विद द सेम फोर्स एंड सिंस द फोर्स इज सेम द फोर्स ऑन द सेकंड स्फीयर ड्यू टू द फर्स्ट विल आल्सो बी पॉइंट टू न्यूटन ओके दैट इज हाउ वी आंसर बोथ दीस क्वेश्चन सो to find the distance between the two spheres you just need to use this equation and to find the force in the second sphere this is how you write all right so hope it's been uh, clear to you guys and thank you for listening and if you have any doubts put your questions in the comment section comment section i will surely reply to you okay bye bye